I'm Gail Donston. This is my husband Tom, and I've been at McKendry since I was born. And Tom, I married into this outfit. <laughs> <laughs> he came along later. Um, our kids, yeah. Natalie and Graham, are now grown and living out on their own, and we are quickly approaching retirement. And we've tried to be good stewards of our money, and we've always tithed, but in you know, we, we've tried to be good stewards because we know that's what God expected of us and give to our church and our church has been foremost in our minds. Look we owned a business for several years. We started one in 91, recently sold it about two and a half years ago. And, um, you know, that, that certainly changed our financial picture from there. And, um, uh, not you know, just not to the negative too badly, but we just don't give as much, but we're giving about the same percentage as we did before. We give extra if there are special projects that are coming along or uh, fundraisers and things needs. like that. Yep. We kick out some extra money. We find, seem to find time for that, uh, money for that. Um, but our priority is the tithe. And we started the FPU University, the Financial Peace University last year, and got ourselves out of debt. So that was a pretty awesome thing. Not to uh, belabor the FPU thing, we, we took that and when we owned the business, we made you know, good money, I'll say. And, uh, you know, and, and we, we both were thinking, oh, if we'd just taken this when we were younger, we'd be in great shape <laughs> now. <laughs> Not that we're hurting, but we could be really uh, in wonderful shape. We learned a lot that, you know, in hindsight, we wish we, you know, we, we, could, we could have done better. But again, our, our main frame has been the, you know, just obedience to God and the, the tithe and the giving and obedience is God's language, love language, works at home too. Well, we but, have uh, been blessed because <laughs> when we had the business, we always tithed on the business's profits at the end of the year as well as our own personal tithe. And I feel like that, that we really were blessed and the business grew tremendously and we benefited from that and when we sold we also tithed on the profits of the sale so and we are in a little bit of a real estate business now and our plan is when we ever sell a house <laughs> that we will the profits will also get a percentage will go to the church that's this right. is just what God asks us to do mm -hmm. it's just what you do that's right and leave some for the kids too but um, it's always a blessing to be able to give, and uh, we enjoy doing that. It's part of us.